Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. It's really dark right now. As you guys saw from the last episode, me and Bradley are fishing a tournament this morning. Super excited about it. Just got here to the ramp. And uh, as you guys can tell, a good bit of people already here. There's probably already 20 boats in the water. And it's five in the morning right now. Got the old boat right here, getting her all ready. Bradley's about to dump me in. It's gonna be a good tournament day. We gonna go out there, try our best, keep that big bass energy up, and go catch them. Made it to our spot, it's about an hour drive. I'm sorry I didn't film this morning, get Bradley in the back. We're gonna go ahead and start off. You guys already know what I'm throwing because of our last video. If you haven't watched that before this tournament, our practice, you should go watch it. I'll link that down below, but we're gonna go ahead and get started, get warmed up out here and uh, see if we're gonna whack them. The water is looking good. It's fairly clear. And um, it was looking like what it was yesterday. And I, I, th I think we're gonna put a hurting on them. We just gotta land the fish. We got the net ready and um, we're gonna start fishing. Just take our time and yeah, we got all day. We're gonna come in here, we're gonna catch five. We're gonna be comfortable. Go to another spot, we'll come back. I think we should fish the cypress trees first. Don't you? Her. There he is. Got him. Get that fish. Yes! Got the monkey off. It's about a pound and a half. First fish right away. That's how it's supposed to go. Been here for three minutes, bucketed up a fish real quick. All right, good little start. He was shallow. He was way shallow. He was on one of that knee, one of them knees up there. He wasn't even on a tree. Give us a couple three pounder, four pounder. I just feel like if you really, I just broke my line. I just broke my line, dude. <laughs> I wish I knew. Good thing I have a backup chatter beat. Good thing I broke off right there. <laughs> it just broke. Well, guys, that ain't what you want to see. I don't understand what that's about. I'm going to throw that one there. Pick up my next rod and go. That's why I rigged up multiple chatterbaits. Something happens. Pick up the next one, you keep fishing. That was weird. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, spit it, spit it, about two pounder. Maybe I shouldn't use this rod. I mean that rod I'm sure is fine, but that other one I can skip a little better with too. I have more confidence in it. Put this reel on that rod. We're gonna, um, we're gonna change this up guys. I don't, not that I don't know about this rod with this chatterbait, but I'm just used to the other one. That's why I was catching them on. I just have a feeling I should be throwing it on that rod and this reel is kind of got me sketched out now because that line broke so I'm just gonna probably retire this one today shouldn't have lost that fish but it's okay we're gonna keep on covering water it's gonna be good keep yeah we were able to cold him he was he was about the same size as the last one and if not he was two pounds he felt good when I hooked him the bite was so soft let me tell you You'd think it'd be an early morning bite that would... You got another one? Get him. Oh yeah. Good job, buddy. It's a 13 inch. Keep her going. Keep her going, son. I'll hunt for real big.
You want to put on that chatterbait? Yeah. Put it that on and we'll just cast. Dude, this reel casts so dang good. Oh my gosh. There he is. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, baby. On the curve 55. It's a fat guy. How scary he's going to spit it. He's barely hooked. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. That's a good little fat guy. You want, you want to put him in? There you go. Heck yeah. Fish number three, baby. Muddy water crawl, curve 55. You want to get a discount? I'll pop it up on the screen. That crankbait catches him. I've been throwing it. What was that? About my fifth cast? Probably about my tenth, maybe. Just load it up on that bad boy. There's a fish in here. It might be a five pounder, bro. If it's a five pounder, I want it. So if it's five pounder, I want it, and I guess I'm gonna come get it. There he is. That's a decent one. Okay, four fish. That's 12 inches? Yeah, easy. Fish number four, guys, we just came back to our first spot. We went and hit something else, and I, you know, we, we talked about it, and we're like, let's just go sack up a limit real quick. We just need one more and get a limit. Hopefully it's a dang good one, too. Give us a five, six pounder to suck that five fish limit off with. It looks like one should be on that. Oh, I got him. Oh, dude, he took off right to the left. I don't know how he didn't get hung. He knocked the dog out of that thing and took off to the left. Yeah, that was my boat. That fish knocked the mess out of this thing, dude. I don't know how he didn't get hooked. Might have been like a warm out. Oh, there he is. Uh-oh. Oh, yes, 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 Bradley. Just grab that. Get him in the net. That's what we need. That's a good one. Crow. Number five, baby. That's a good fish. Let me see that one. That's a good one. Gotta keep double hands for double hands. <laughs> That's about two and a half, ain't it? Going in the other side. Yeah. You got one. Oh my. oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Come on, Bradley. Just let him let her run if he needs to. Alright. Alright. Perfect. Perfect. You're good. You're good, buddy. You're good. That's a good fish. Just get her right up to my net. Get her right up to my net, baby. <laughs> Trick one. Two pounder. One. Trick one. Dude, they're on that dang tree. Bro, we just need to stick on that tree. I'm serious. You switched up baits and that's a good fish. That's a coal. Hold that one out and put him in there. Oh, I think yeah, that's, that's a good one. Two's a good one. What about this one? That's a good one. Is there one in there? Yeah, that's the big one. That's a big one. So this is the smallest? Yeah. Look at that coal. Hold those up. Oh, yep, yeah, double its size. But, oh my God, Bradley. Get him. Uh oh, Bradley. I got him. <laughs> oh, it's a giant mud. Dude, look how thick that thing is. I just call it fat cramp. You what? I just call it fat cramp. You alright? Yeah, I'm good now. What in the world just happened? That was hectic. <laughs> Alright. All of a sudden my rod just felt jong jong jong. I'm like, hold up, wait a minute. It's getting hot now. I think that's what we need though. That's the oh. Dude. Uh, oh, he's still on. He, he he's still on. He just pulled back on me. I think it's it, it's either a good bass or this is a mudfish. I think he's still on there. 
Feel his head shaking? Uh -uh. I, but he pulled back on me when I let off the pressure. I got a lot of pressure on him. Oh, yeah, he's on there. He's on there. Oh, uh, okay. Why are they always that small? What about the net, what about the net skills? <laughs> Why are they always that small when they do that, when we get them hung? You notice that? We've done that three times the last couple times. weeks. These are the crawls that we're throwing. They're called emerald emerald blue. Bradley likes this. Bradley likes this color. Shoot. It honestly looks like just a lighter June bug. It's a more neon. Ooh, there he is. There he is, Bradley. Hey, I need the net on this one. Right side, he's a big bass, big bass. Yes! That's what we need. It's a two and a half pounder right there. Yes! We got it. We're gonna have a good bag by the time we get out of here. You scared the dog out of me on that one. Bro, he jumped out the net. Had too much water. That's a good fish, bro. We got. We just caught three good ones back to back. That one? That's our smallest? I ain't a bad, oh, maybe that one. I wish I had my beam. I don't know if I have my beam in here. That might be the smallest actually that you just put in. We got one loose. That's gonna be close. They're about the same. We need to weigh them. All right guys, we just, I, my GoPro shut off, it, it died, but we had two fish that were pretty. I just had one. They are in here, Bradley. Let me rig up. <laughs> this is my next cast. Um, we had two fish that were pretty identical in there. One was 134 and the other was 138. So we culled out the 134. So our smallest fish right now is one pound, 0.38. That is our smallest fish. Um, technically, we just need to catch two more like we just caught, those, those three that we just caught, and we'll cull out those other ones and we'll have about a set of two pounders. That one I just caught is probably mid twos. Yeah, there he is. That's a good one too. I don't know if he's... 116, it's a little smaller than... No, no, he ain't good. The keeper, I might, I might deepen up back here though. It would make sense. We'll see if he'll hit me again. Yep. Yep. Got him that time. It's a bass. I don't know if he's big enough, but <sighs> nope. That went, I don't know how it came off. Get him. Get him. Big. Oh my God. Big. It's a huge mud. Jesus, they're huge up here. You got it, Nick. That might have actually been a big bag. Look, at, look at the head on that thing. I just want you to look at this. Trust me, I know that's... Dude, that thing's so big. Holy cow, dude. That is the biggest mud I've ever seen. Yeah. Keeper? Yeah. Close. Way in the You can try it. I think it's going to keep it anyways. Got it. Nope. 114. Throw back. Yeah, throw it back. Oh my god. Oh, it's five pounder. Oh, really? Five pounder. five pounder. Oh my god. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, yes. 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 Really? Too big. Oh my god, he's really big. That's exactly what we need. Exactly what we need. Get him. I don't see him. Oh my god. Yes! Dude, get the thing in the boat, son. Yes! That's a four pounder. Oh, there's another one. I gotta get back in there. Alright, here, I'm gonna get you off. Bro, bro, you don't understand. I, that was the that was the small bite I had. What, dude? That's almost a four pounder. I don't even know. If my camera mic's working. Sorry, guys, if it sounds a little weird, just bear with me for a minute. Yeah, Zero it out. This is a big fish, bro. Nice one. Three and a half, four. We needed that. That's what I was looking for, bro. Three, three nine zero. 
four-pounder. Four pounder. Yes! <laughs> That's it right there, Bradley. Good job. Put him on the big side, son. All right, this next fish we catch, we really gotta, we gotta weigh all those fish. That's a freaking good one, dude. Four pounder. Good Bro, freaking job. Was that the crankbait? Yeah. Dude, gosh. We staying in here. Bradley just caught one of our big fish. I, golly, man. That was a good one. It was 390, so pretty much a four pounder. That's exactly what we needed. That's exactly what we wanted. And we are sitting dang good right now. And um, he caught that thing on that crankbait. That's the Curve 55 by six cents. Um, if you want 10% off, you can check it out. Use my code. But um, that's exactly what we need, guys. It, we couldn't ask for a better little start here. That's a good freaking fish he just caught. So now we pretty much have four fish around two pounds and a four pounder. And it's only, note that we're fishing till 4.15. Another thing, I'm sorry about the audio acting weird. Um, I, the audio is weird on that clip. I already know, just sorry about that. But it's 11.30 right now. It's 11.28. We have to be back at the boat ramp, which we have about an hour drive. We have to be back there at 4.15. So we have, we have five, we have about four hours of fishing left to catch like two four pounders. I don't blame you. There he is. No yep. Got him? Yep. Look at him boil. I don't know. Look at the boil though. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Keep him down, keep him down, keep him down. He's keep coming now. I don't think he's big enough. Yeah, he is. I don't think he is. Nah. <sighs> Look how fat he is. Yeah. He's loaded up. It's basic. This is what? Five cast in though? Well, sadly, we cannot use that one, even though, look how fat his belly is. You can double check, double check. I'm telling you the rest of them, I'm pretty sure are two pounds. I just threw him back, whatever. Yeah. I crank on dang ledges and... Oh man, Bradley right there. Oh my gosh, no! Oh! It's all right. 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 Only about two pounds. You're crazy, bro. That was a three and a half pounder. Oh my god. He barely had it. God. I think the big ones are pulling up. Uh-uh. Bro, if I still got him, his head's shaking. Nuh-uh. He's he's in there. Oh my god, he came out. He came out. He came out. It looks like a decent one. Oh yeah, that's a good one, Bradley. Get him in here. That's a three freaking pounder, son. Very close. Very close. He's gonna call. <laughs> oh, dude, those crankbaits scared the mess out of me. That's why I lost that fish up there. That fish I lost was about that size. That's a three pounder. Bro, if we'd have had that one, we'd have been All right, now we gotta weigh these fish. Two two nine, one eight nine, two two seven. It's our smallest one. We need to get that 190. That's our smallest fish is 190. 227? Yeah, 227. This is our second smallest. 211. 275, exactly. All right, weighs 196. We he's still, he's still the smallest. All right, guys, we are culling out our smallest one, and that is a two pounder. It's like one, what did I say? 193? 197? There's a lot of tournaments that we would need that one. I'll tell you that right now, especially out here. I don't know. Where are you going? Oh, that's some mud. It's a mud. I still gotta get the crankbait there. Oh my god. You want me to scoop him? It's gonna be aggravating. Oh my god. You got me so excited. Oh, you came off. Grab that crankbait. Oh my gosh. It's definitely a mud fish. Look at my line. Look at my rod. It's a pickerel again. What? You don't catch those that often. That's probably my fifth pickerel out here. We get a bonus? Yeah. That hook. Dude, I didn't even feel... That's him. That's him. That's him. That's actually him. I can't see. Alright. Oh, yes! 
I think this will be our third biggest. Wow, what a long freaking day, guys. We are back at the ramp now. Got my boy Bradley down there. We're about to load the fish in the bag, weigh him in. As you guys can tell, a bunch of boats behind us. I think there's around 70 boats today. Um, we caught about 15, 10, around 10 fish off camera. Um, you know, my GoPro was actually messed up today and I, I was so hot I just had to get it off me. Um, but we only made one other coal and uh, we got a decent little bag, but we're gonna go ahead and get them out, go weigh them, and see what we got. Came in, I didn't have no red mile. I want to get red mile on That's our smallest. Decent. Two and a quarter. Oh, we could have cooled these out. I know, man. I know. That's about our smallest, I think. I know. We got about three that are identical like that. Noah was enthusiastic. He kept me pumped up. He's good. Like every time I caught a fish, that's Noah that. was like, yes. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. You sick now? I think that's yours. I might have not. It's not a big one. No. It ain't big. They're all just so. I mean, they're good ones. For a three of ones, like the game. That's all I'm saying. Places unfair. That's, that's, that's Bradley. Bro. That's Bradley's big one. Well, mine was bigger than that. Good one. You know, was it? Bro. Yeah, it was. Yeah, she's a little short of four. Three point like, nine. Like nine. Mine was four. Four fifty four. That's four good. That's yeah. a good one. Here's what we call. We have a that is going to conclude it for this tournament video you guys are probably asking noah what did you guys have what did you what did you guys finish in well you know going into this tournament you know the last video the practice video we we feel very confident we're like man i think we're on the fish as long as we come here tomorrow and catch them we should be able to win it and um sadly that did not happen this tournament we ended up finishing fourth place and um, we got a top five finish can't really complain about that i believe there is between 60 to 70 boats you know it's one of the biggest tournaments on the river this year and to say that we got a top five you know that's not bad at all um after we weighed in we were in second place for the longest time then two more people came in and someone beat us by i believe a couple of ounces and then the second place boat i want to say they had a high 14 or a low 15 it was somewhere between there and 17 pounds 1750 ended up winning the tournament but uh needless to say i think we're gonna end up fishing one this weekend so if you guys have any ideas for the tournament video this upcoming weekend drop some comments down below if you guys want to see like a different style or maybe a different camera angle because i'm thinking about putting the camera on the dash let me know down below and we'll do that for you guys but thank you guys so much we had a blast at this tournament more tournament videos coming hit that freaking like button hit the subscribe button if you haven't already and i'll catch you guys in the next video